I will make this as quick as possible and try to stick to the facts. Um, and I will reiterate one last time, if you really don't care about my life, this will mean absolutely nothing to you, and that's fine, because I know that people on Facebook don't always really give a shit about somebody else, and I make cuss, by the way. Um, so if you're watching this, that means that you really do care about my life and want it to be great, and so that is my disclaimer. So if you don't really give a shit, stop watching now. And I will also say this is not going to be as exciting as you all may think. I don't know what you may think. I was kind of hoping somebody would be like, oh, so is it this? Just so I can say, no, it's not. So um, I'm going to talk really fast because I want to keep it under five minutes. So here we go. Um, as any of you who give a shit know, I have been um, volunteering at the hospital since December. And I am moving up the ladder. And this morning, I decided and I emailed the right people that I am going to run for the president of the board at the hospital for the volunteers. Now you may think, oh, big whoop, that doesn't pay shit. Now, stick with me here. Why this is important, I am going to meet a ton of influential people, and my main goal is to get a job working at the hospital. Well, as the president of the board, which would be in charge of, like, all the volunteers, I mean, there is a boss that they pay, but then I'd be, like, right there next to her. Um... I would have like this great Donald Trumpian power. I had to say that. I just had to say that. Um, but it would be a huge deal. And the reason I think it would be life changing is what I just said because I would like be hanging out with the actual president and CEO of the hospital. So I've already told them, I've told my boss, I want to work here. And so you can pay me and I will work at the hospital until I turn 70, at which point I will retire. Which means that my life, which has been so shitty, for so long, and yes it has been, and if you don't think it has, you don't know me at all, um, this would set it on the right path. So, it is a, from what I've been told, a 95% chance that, not to sound like I'm this great, but I am when it comes to the hospital, I guess, but just by telling them, hey, I want to do this, I'm going to do this. It's a three-year thing. You start as vice president the first year then you become president and then you're the past president and so you get to hang out and help the new president so that is the big deal and it is a big deal it sounds like nothing but it's a really big deal and you're all you know 95 percent of you so like two out of three that's 66 percent are sitting there right now going big fucking deal it is a big fucking deal now, I still have to be, like, confirmed, and they have to say, yes, that's great, we want you, but like I said, I would be very surprised if that didn't happen, but it might not be officially confirmed until, like, April. Um, so, but I'm not putting the proverbial cart before the horse, because, like I said, I've been, I've been talking about it for three weeks, making sure it's something I can do, and you do a lot of fun and neat shit. Four days at Mackinac Island, paid four days at Crystal Mountain, which I don't even know what that is. It's all paid for. Um, and it's, and that's just part of it. You will see me in the local paper like this. Um, it's a big deal. It's a really big deal. So that's it. Sorry that I probably disappointed most of you, but like say, if you really love me and want me to succeed in life, it's a big deal. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Four minutes, that's as fast as I've ever been. Alright, um, yeah, and if you ever want to, like, talk, um, you can email me on this machine right here. This, not this one, this is my one. Okay, um, I'm rambling, so I'm stopping now. Bye.